Hi everyone, how's it going? Lee J two five one two here. Um, I thought I would show something kind of funky off. It's this little freaky looking thing here. It's the Skellergro replica bottle, a water bottle, and I thought I would show it off. Uh, it's something little that I've had for a little uh, for a while now, and I probably should have done a video on it uh, probably a week ago. But then I, I, I wanted to show off the um, love potion instead, so I did that. So this is, I think these are kind of available everywhere. It's not like a Noble Collection replica. Uh, it's just, or it might be actually, hang on. Just yeah. tape on his head now. Ew, it's sticky. Uh, I don't think it's Noble Collection, no. It's just, focus. There we go. It's 300 milliliters with a functioning thing. Screen accurate, like from the Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets when Harry has to get his arm back because of Lockhart. Uh, yeah, so let's have a look at the actual thing. So, no, oh, that was easier than I thought. Okay, I have scissors, do I need them? Yes. I have been tempted to use this for work, but I think people would wonder what was wrong with me if I brought this in. I don't know, I might, I might use it. Now, uh, this is, this is pretty cool. It looks, uh, yeah, bone regenerator, Skelligro, bona fide results every time. Sold by Rubens Winnicus and Company Incorporated. And then you got a bunch of stuff at the bottom. So I'm guessing that's who makes it. Uh, okay, Jim Jim Henson Studios. Isn't he from the Muppets? I don't know, I could be wrong about that. So let's have a look at the actual water bottle itself. Uh, you get the, obviously the skull here. It's a little bit sticky on top here now because of the tape, that's annoying. Uh, so which, how does it, which part does it come off of this bit? Okay, screw the bottle top, and then you can fit your water in there, or whatever you like. Um, <laughs> looks quite strange without it, but how does it smell? Yeah, I need to give that a wash after it smells uh, very much of plastic. And But that is cool. Um, Skiller grow for use by healers only. I don't know, should I use this for work? <laughs> Turning up, turn up with this. Hi guys. <laughs> Uh, I might do. It's pretty cool. This is, you know, it's one of those um, relatively cheap products uh, in in terms of price, so the, but the quality is still really nice. Um, I think it was about ten pounds or something from different. I think well, you can get them from most shops. So I got it from Tesco. You get it from most supermarkets probably if they have like a dedicated toy slash Harry Potter section, and wherever you are, if you're in the states, maybe I don't know Walmart or something might have it. I don't. I'm not sure. But it's a nice little thing. It's a nice little replica. I'm, I'm tempted just to put it on my shelf, on my display, because it is, and I, you know, you know me. I like screen accurate prop replicas, and this is screen. This is screen accurate, so it does seem like it could work uh, as a proper replica, um, or I could just use it as a water bottle for work, because you know it is just plastic, but. I like it. It's it's very cool. And they didn't have to make this, obviously. It's quite a niche thing. It's quite a very specific thing. Not many people are going to get this reference. Only people that have seen the second movie a lot of times and notice this will get this reference. So uh, that's that's why I like it. Um, and also it's accurate for the films. So it's something... Is that... For, yeah, yeah, there we go. So I, I like that they're doing this. You know, they've been doing this whole... I know, a brand new line of Harry Potter products for a couple of years now. And they seem to be, you know, doing really well. All the products seem to be really well made. A lot of them are good price-wise, and they're good. Some of them are good collectibles as well. I just, you can tell it's part of the new line if it's got this kind of packaging on it. But it's been that well. It's been that for a while now, and obviously there's got new stuff coming out as well, like toys and figures and more wands and things. Noble Collection uh, make things with this packaging on it as well now as we've seen in previous videos. So it's very cool, I like it. Um, it feels light, it doesn't feel kind of, 
it, it's not like it's not weighty it's quite a light thing it's just a normal water plastic bottle really but I, I like it a lot it's quite creepy I, <laughs> I have to say I don't think I will bring it into work to do with me uh, I'll probably leave it on a shelf somewhere <laughs> But that's it for me guys, just a little quick thing that I thought was cool. I like uh, buying these little things because they're interesting to show and I actually use them as well. I can actually get some use out of it. Um, so yeah, that's it for me. If you've got any questions or if you guys have, if you guys use this for school, college, work, whatever, let me know. And if you have any uh, weird looks from people. <laughs> right, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye bye.